There you go. Today we look at uh, WinCC Flexible and Semantic Manager using a uh, recipe in this one. Um, so in Semantic Manager to get the recipe data in, we've uh, created a, a DB, a data block. And mine here is called DB2, recipe data from HMI. And over in WinCC Flexible, we created a recipe. Well, we can choose, um, say, three different flavors. If we have mango, we can choose mango drink, mango juice, and mango water. So with the mango drink, we have 50% water, or 50, it's called like milliliters of water. And the sugar will be, yeah, I'll just put some numbers in, 10. And the uh, mango puree, mango juice, got a lot more mango puree, less sugar, less water. And mango water, just water and a little bit of mango puree. And we can download each of these. Um, the values here go straight to the database or the data block in Semantic Manager that we have there. Let's go to pineapple. Uh, let's say pineapple drink. Download that. The values come in here. Uh, to create that, uh, let's minimize PSEs in there. To create that, uh, in WinCC Flexible 2008 version, this one you just add a screen here. We call it a recipe screen, and then you go down here, add the recipe, you give the recipe a name and the display name for it, recipe number, and then we have the different variations of. Um, here is uh, the ingredients that, that's going to be used. And here we are the different variations of mango, for, for this case. Mango drink, mango juice, mango water. Then you add just the values here that you want to transfer it to um, Semantic Manager. If we go to orange. And it's basically the same thing and uh, to the data block there or the data record same thing for pineapple go to the data record same thing there now on the recipe screen you gotta go to enhanced objects and just add the recipe view and uh, yeah that's about it uh, and the settings for this, um, there's not, not much here to set up. Press a simple view or enhanced view. Buttons, those are the buttons that comes here. You can choose what you want there. And I guess you can have security, that type of stuff. And uh, yeah, um, <clears throat> in uh, schematic manager, uh, we the database, as I said, I created here and I put the values, the names in. This is gonna be DB2, and uh, if you go back over to WinCC Flexible. You gotta add the tags there to be able to use them. So I got, these are from different stuff that I, I was doing before, but from here it's the water. And you see it goes to db2.dbd, dbw0, which is this, dbw2 for sugar, which is this, four for mango puree, which is that, six for Pineapple puree and eat for orange puree.
Yeah, basically, yeah, that's it. Um, any questions? Just ask. Once again, just click one through here, and uh, the values get updated. Okay, thank you.